How to involve students in setting up their own ground rules. With Herbert Puchter. Personalization is a very important aspect of learning a foreign language. As we can only claim that our students have learned the language successfully, if they manage to express themselves in it, that is, if they are able to verbalize their thoughts and feelings in English. However, personalization, as important as it is, is not easy to achieve with teenage students. They often don't want to talk about themselves. Getting them to develop their own ground rules for the English class might be a first step towards personalization. It's a topic that is very relevant to them, so it's very likely they will want to contribute. On the other hand, it's safe as it's about something that belongs to the public domain, uh, so to speak, concerning teachers and students alike. The way you can introduce this is to get your students to think of suggestions for ground rules they'd like to make. Write these three prompts on the board. Something I've noticed a change I'd like to see and a rule I'd like to suggest. Point out to them that you trust they'll make suggestions that are constructive, that will, in other words, make life uh, together easier for everyone in class, including you. So there would be no point in suggesting, for example, that students would never take any test ever again. Then give them an example of a suggestion you'd like to see implemented. For example, tell them that you are not too happy about the fact that it always takes such a long time at the beginning of the lesson to collect all the homework books. Write, collecting homework takes a long time under the first prompt. Say that you'd like to change this and the change you would like to see is that it takes far less time for you to get the homework books. Under the second prompt, write, collecting homework takes very little time. Say that you'd like to introduce a rule that everybody puts their homework book on your desk in the break before the lesson. Write, Students put homework on teacher's desk before the lesson under the third prompt. Give the students enough time to think and individually make notes as suggested. Then ask them to work in groups to discuss the various suggestions. Ask one student in each group uh, to take notes and report to the class later. Finally, when all the reports have been heard, write uh, the suggestions on the board and work on them a bit more together with your students so that you get some kind of class charter that can be written on a large sheet of paper. This charter should be hung on the wall and signed by the students and yourself to give importance to it. Of course, it's paramount that not only your students, but you yourself stick to the rules.